Northampton Saints travel to a foggy Salford City Stadium to play a rock-bottom team in Shale Sharks, who had their first game under a new managerial structure, with the newly appointed John Mitchell at the helm. Seven, the two fly halves, Ryan Lamb and Nick McLeod, exchanged penalties early on before a blindside move from a line-out drive, at least when Jim Elliott after some quick hands from scrum half Martin Roberts. Lamb converted the try, and it started a run of points for the visiting team before half-time. Firstly, a turnover at the ruck went wide, and the huge Tongan prop, Suane Tongawea, appeared through the fog to take the lead to 15-3. A series of slow rucks near the sale 22 gave Saints fly half Ryan Lamb the impetus to take advantage of the territory in possession, eventually striking a clean drop goal, which stretched the lead to 17 points. Then, just before half-time, the away side made the killer blow. A mistimed switch between Nick McLeod and replacement centre corner ace was happily collected by opposite centre replacement Tom May, who had an open field to run in the try. Lamb converted, and the Saints went into the half 24 points ahead. The second half showed a promising start for the Sharks. After a period of good possession for the home side, they stretched the Saints' defence eventually, giving Matt Quater the chance to draw his opposite man and release fullback Rob Miller to score in the corner. Six minutes later, Sale saw McLeod get another chance to chip away at the Saints' lead, and McLeod converted through the fog with ease. Chance for a losing bonus point. The next 20 minutes saw a lull in play from both sides, before finally, in the 77th minute, Hooker Tony Taylor was on the end of a catch and drive, which the TMO had judged to have been touched down. McLeod failed to convert. The final score, 27 points to 16 to the Saints. Sale still rooted to the bottom of the table.